Bath is one of Britain's most popular destinations, so much so that the entire city has been designated a World Heritage Site. A lot of the city is pretty much unchanged from the 18th century, when it boomed as a spa resort and was a place where high society would come to party and play. But the history of the city actually goes back a lot further. The Roman baths here are the best preserved in the world, even better than Rome. The water's still steaming hot, even today. Inside, the pump room was where high society came for health treatments. Now the treats are of a more edible kind, but there's still a chance to taste the spa water. you can still go for a dip at the newly built Thermai Bath Spa. The warm water still bubbles up from underground, making you so relaxed that you won't want to get out. But you should because there are some stunning views across the city from the rooftop, and there's another pool to enjoy too. As well as its waters, Bath also stands out for its architecture. There are loads of examples of Georgian buildings, most famously the Royal Crescent. A sweeping line of terraced houses close to the city centre. Bath's been home to quite a few famous names. The Jane Austen Centre celebrates its most famous novelist. There's even a chance to have a cup of tea with some of her characters. There's plenty of shopping in Bath down cobbled streets and passageways. And once you've had enough of that, you can always stop off at Sally Lunn's Tea Room, the oldest building in the city. history, the waters, the buildings and the beauty all make Bath one of the must-see attractions of Britain. <laughs>